Hello everyone and welcome back to Void Space Alpha. My name is Ollie and today we are continuing with our playthrough of Baldur's Gate 3. Do you know what? I totally forgot because I record these in blocks of like two or three episodes at a time. Completely forgot that Shadowheart has a little zombie <laughs> knocking around. Whatever it takes. Um, was that from the necromancy spell that she had? Yeah, animate dead. I don't think there's any dead in here to... Oh, there is. There's a couple. Um, okay. Right, anyways, yeah, we're not going to do that. What we were going to do last time where we finished the episode... Uh, and look, you know, where's my manners? A massive thank you to the 11,000 people that have subscribed to the channel so far, and thanks so much to all the people that have um, yeah, left a comment and engaged in conversation. God, my brain has gone completely blank. Yeah, but last time we spoke to this lady, and uh, I feel like we were going to try the door. It requires an item... Uh, I don't have any idea what that might be. I can't inspect that. Oh, it's one of the, it was one of these gems that they put in, wasn't it? So do we... What, what do we do now? Okay. There's a quest here. Discover the artifact secrets. Talk to the captain of the Gift Yankee Crush. We did that, didn't we? Commander of the Crush. I presume you are not stupid enough to return empty-handed. So, give me the weapon, now. Uh, deception. I've not found it yet, but I'm close. Oh, we're going to need guidance on that. Definitely. Okay, we've got 20. That's good. Time is finite, as is my patience. Go! Yeah, they do love their um, red-encrusted jemmy stuff, don't they? But I don't know what the... How to complete that quest. We could tell her about it. What's this one here? Travel through the mountain pass. Reclaim the blue jay's nest. That means I've got to get to the top. Still don't know how to do that. So we definitely can't give the artifact to the captain. So I, I genuinely don't know what to do from here. And I feel like the Git Yankee might. I'm just going to say this. They might be dicks. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come and explore down this way, which is past the waypoint into here. Yeah, there's a bit to explore up here. That's right. Right. Yeah, and then we might have to just, you know, tactically clear out this area. Raider Garat. I see they're letting even Istic mercenaries in these days. Okay, these people are not happy to hear from Leave us. Me alone. The watch must remain undisturbed. Now, I hate to admit this, but I am feeling a bit murder hobo y. So if there is nothing else to discover. It's a heavy chest here. Ooh, an arrow of fire. And a potion of healing. Oh, there's some nice stuff here. Get the Yankee short sword, a decorated barrel, thumb melon. Okay, there's a there's a door here. Let's see. Auto saving is never a good sign. But yeah, I don't know if I just succumb to the inner murder hobo in me and just clear out the Get Yankee crash. They're obviously not great people. Okay, right, that puts us properly on the outskirts of... Oh, there's some jumping platforms here. Okay. Let's get ourselves over. Poor little Will might not be able to get over. And the zombie? Okay, the zombie can make it. Right. Is there... Oh, there's some vines. Okay, that's good. Can I get to the eagle nest from up here? There is a chest here, an elegant chest. Or another arrow of fire, arrow of darkness, arrow of lightning, and elixir of vigilance. That's not a bad haul. Let's carry on looking around. Looks like there's another jumping platform here. And some more vines. Let's get everyone over first. Yep, that's all good. Climb up these vines. This legitimately might be the way to the eagle's nest that we got from that blue jay. 
yeah, it looks like we're getting to the top of the temple here. Okay, let's carry on. There's a skeleton. He just has a sword. Wispweed. Okie dokie. Um, right. Oh, we've been in here, haven't we? Let's climb up there. Get everyone through. Pretty sure I've checked all of this. Guardian of Faith. Hmm. Oh, there's a that? crumbly wall. We've absolutely got to hit that crumbly wall. Just blunt my weapon on the brickwork by stabbing it. I don't know why you'd stab it instead of bashing it. Okay. Guardian of Faith, level 7. Guardian of Faith spell, and a remarkably long-lasting one at that. Right, can I disconnect Ardo? Right, I've got a gilded chest here. Mugwort, going to be useful. Wispweed's going to be useful. Bit of gold. Last notes of a monk, no thank you. Ceremonial Battleaxe, axe. That's definitely planted there. To test us, yep, yeah, and that is initiated combat, okay. Got 35% on that. It's the only spell that will can fire, really. So he does get to do 8 damage. And I need you to get in and get around the corner. Jump. There we go, that gets Will out of the way. Tarlac. You can rage as a bonus action, right? You can. You can't then reckless attack. Because that would be two That's bonus cool. actions. Oof. This is not going well. Oh, gosh, yeah. Okay, now I can reckless attack. There's a pretty good chance I'll kill him. Okay, that's good. Karlak did not uh, suffer well there. A bit of gold on these skellies. I think that might be the best time for a long rest, actually. <laughs> Let's head back to camp. We've got no short rests left in us, and Will's down to zero spell slots. Karlak's down to, I think, six health. So, um, yeah, now might be the best time to catch some shut-eye. Yes, I would love to end the day, if possible. The zombie is going to go, right? Because it only... Somebody in the camp still wishes to speak to me. Uh... It's not you, is it, zombie? Who wishes to speak to me? Moving ahead. It's not you guys. So it must be down here. So that's Lazel. Or the Oathbreaker. It is Lazel. Okay. Hmm. Just thought of something. It is Lazel, isn't it? It's not Laziel. I think I've called her Laziel for the first thirty episodes. The Sethisk. It might have killed you. I felt your torment. The yeah. gods still tampered with it. Traitor. And there may be more still. This must be why the Inquisitors come. I am going to have to try to kill all the Githyanki. Vlakith does not abandon Githyanki. The Zethis was tampered with. There is no other explanation. No hurry. We must go to the Chirai and inform him of the Doctor's sedition. The Chirai. Okay. Well, we're going to have a sleep. I don't know what a Chirai is. Here goes nothing. I'm guessing that zombie goes at the end of a long rest. Uh, yeah, let's auto-select that. I think most of the carrying weight of Ardo at the moment is just camp supplies. I'm such a hoarder. It's, uh, yeah, it's getting ridiculous. Right, let's leave camp immediately. That guardian spirit is done. Right, we need to figure out a way to get onto the roof and deal with these... These eagles, at least. Has that updated the other quest? No, discover the artifact secrets. No. Okay, do you know what? You should probably rejoin the party, are they? Uh, was there anything on this skeleton? No, I definitely did loot through here. I'm not going to make you watch me loot again. Let's jump over here. Uh, 
that was the way to the crash. So how do we get onto the roof? I'm sure there's people in the comments letting me know. What's the stained glass window do? The monastery's notable keepers adorn these intricate panels. Okay. Failed a religion check. Um, examine the image for the Dawn Master Seed. The reconsecration of the monastery conducted by Dawn Master Seed. Oh, right, that's a person. Uh, take a look. Inspect the broken Dawn stained glass Master window. Saeed wielding the rest of the inscription and picture has shattered away. Okay. Um, yeah, I think we just leave that. Oh, an old key. In my pack. Ceremonial longsword. That's definitely a bait trap as well. I didn't look at the ceremonial battle act either. Uh, ceremonial longsword is 8 to 17 with extra acid damage. I think everything I've got on has got extra acid damage at the moment. Where's that ceremonial battle axe? 8 to 17 as well. Karlak, you are currently using a 7 to 21. If I select you, 6 to 15, could you potentially do two one-handed weapons? Um, Let's put that back in there, just so I know. Can I swap that out for that and then give you the battle axe in the offhand? Mm, no, I've got no offhand weapons with me. Uh, okay, you're going to go great axe for now. I'll give you the ceremonial weapons anyway. Right, so there's obviously nothing else in here, unless... Hang on, can I get through here? I can get through here. Interesting. I am controlling Karlak though. Let's, get going. Let's control Ardo. Slow down. Is this my way onto the roof? Oh, there's that would have been a way in. There's mul there's always multiple ways in. Um right, okay, so we can get potentially Ah, there's another area over here. Okay. Now we're starting to find things and there's vines up. Okay. It's happening. Right, let's go. Oh, a dirt mound. Let's dig. I'm digging without the shovel. Let's open the wooden chest. What have we got? A war pick? No, a longbow. Perhaps. Um, I mean, they're sellable. Let's take them. Scramble up here. There's an opulent chest. Uh, arcane Cultivation gains an additional two spell slots, replaces effects from other elixirs when drunk. Okay, we'll take that, we'll take that. That's a silver ingot, that's got sale value, and some gold. Scroll of Revivify. Let's see what this does. Can I get onto the roof from here? Uh, let's lockpick it. The rest. I didn't even use Guidance then. Should have. Take that scroll of revivify. Um, the crash yellow. No, we want to get onto the roof, really, but I don't know how to do it. Oh, that's the area that we came in at. Perhaps we can head over this way. Where does that take us? I'm just going to follow them now. Just going to watch them. Right, back through here. As you go down this corridor, through here, still not a thousand percent sure on how I get to these blue jays. All right, okay, up here. Ah, okay, this is a new area, I think. Yeah, because I just gained some experience, so it's almost definitely a new. Okay, that's an eagle, giant eagle. Right, we found them. There's a ceremonial warhammer I just saw there as well. He's annoyed. The eagle regards you with disdain. I don't know why the narrator's not speaking. Uh, let's try an animal handling check. I am going to use guidance. 
We got a 19. That's a success. Eagle seems satisfied, but keeps a watchful eye on you. Okie dokie. Right, I need uh, some sort of potion of animal speaking. There we go. Let's have a chat to him again. You can pass, but you're not to talk to me. Gross. <laughs> that is marvellous. Okay. Intruder in my nest! This area was meant to be safe. Xavier, get behind mummy. Oh, mummy. Um, it's not your nest. You stole it from a little bird who used to live here. Oh, okay. That just immediately triggers combat. And he just called him mummy. Right, let's have us rebuke that straight off the bat. Right, Shadow Heart. I mean, what's the best bet for you? Probably just trying to do a bonk. And then maybe ensnaring. Save the ensnare. Right, Ardo, you are just going to attack normally. He rolled a 16. I'm going to use it to get a crit. And then a second hit. There we are. Sorry about that very brief interruption. I am back. I am going to attempt to <laughs> try and finish this fight. Uh, right, Will, your Eldritch Blast is not going to do much, but you've got a slightly better chance of poking him with your pointy sword. So I might do that, and I might attempt to flourish. I mean, this definitely devolved into combat a lot sooner than I was expecting. Oh, I forgot to rage. Should do that as a bonus action. That's free damage we're missing out on, right? Isn't it? Um, yeah, you can use dash as a bonus action. Disadvantage on opportunity attacks. Additional two damage, yeah. So we just missed out on two. There you are. Might not have killed him. If that was the case before. We'll take that eagle feather. There we go. Ceremonial warhammer. Right. Shadow heart. Can you just hit this guy? No. Shadowheart, you are really crap, but you have just given Ardo advantage, so we'll take that. What was that thing? A dead kobold. Eagle feather, I'll take it. Ancient giant egg. Take those feathers as well. Uh, right, well that is definitely the eagle slain. Uh, right, let's have a mooch around here and see what else there is before we decide to go murder Hobo on the Githyanki Crash. Right, there's definitely something over here. Let's see if we can get over in that direction. It's going to be this way, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it definitely is going to be this way. We're going to jump down. Oh, we're going to lose HP for jumping down. I might just have a look over there with Ardo. Unless I can... I don't think I can jump over there with... Why am I so scared about losing 4 HP? There we are. Skeleton? Nope. Okay. Is there anything... There might be something over there. Let's, let's investigate this area first. Well, there's a chest over here. A painted chest. Oh, cool, the helmet. The Holy Lance helmet. Oh, my God. Might the Graceless. Creatures who miss their attack rolls. God, why, why did I click? Uh, against the wearer must make a dexterity saving throw or take one to four radiant damage. That's pretty good. Um, okay. And now I need to go and check in this area over here. Let's have a look what goodies are in store. No, it's just a pouch. I'm guessing it might just be gold. They might just be gold. Gold's always useful. There's a skeleton on the floor. He's got a candle. Still burning. Oh, a greater health potion. That is worth it. Okie dokie. Right, well, I think we're going to speak to that blue jay. See what the deal is. In fact, why am I moving around? I need to go to the waypoint. There we are. That brings everyone... And I've only just now noticed that our undead creature did vanish at the end. So, wasn't the blue jay over here somewhere? 
Was he not? I can't actually remember. I feel like he was up this path. Yeah, because I need to jump over to speak to him. I think I might have done. Yeah, jump over there. Trying to remember where things are. I can hear him. Oh, there he is. Seems yes, like Mr. Blue Jay. Jay. Let me guess. Defeat. What is to be expected? Eagles are invincible after all. Uh, they're not invincible. I just haven't got around to it yet. Oh, I have got around to it. I killed them. Typical arrogance. Remember, tall one, pride comes... Hang on, why is it telling me that I haven't killed them? Okay, let's get back to the monastery. I definitely did kill them. Right? All oh, right, yeah. Let's climb up this way. This was the way we went in, wasn't it? I think. Let's jump over this direction. Can I climb through anywhere else? There's a barricade here. Uh, we just got to shoot it. This is definitely not the way we went in. Is that climbable, those vines? No. Right, let's get through here. Okay, we're in. This was the room with all the Grimishka. Well, there's an oil of sharpness there. Um, yeah, so we actually wanted to be out here, didn't we? And we climbed up there. I think. I'm trying to remember how we got back to the top now. He's saying we didn't kill the eagles, but we definitely, definitely killed the eagles. Oh, right, that was easy. We did get back up there. Crystals. Um, right, how do I interact with these? Like that. Can I use it? It's not doing anything. Better not be cursed. Can I do anything with any of these? No, I can't. So how do I actually reclaim the Blue Jay's nest? The eagles are dead. Have I got a speak with dead potion? No, I've just got animal speaking. Does Shadowheart have a speak with dead spell? Um, how do I get into your spells? P? No. L? Might be L. Spellbook. Here we go. So she currently has those spells. Oh, she can turn undead. Bestow curse. Trickery domain. Right, okay. Well, look, rather than making you guys watch me try to figure this out, which I'm sure is not interesting in the slightest, I'm going to end the episode here. Quickly Google what I have to do to finish this, uh, this specific quest line. And, uh, yeah, I'm sure there's going to be loads of comments down below saying, hey, you just needed to do X, Y, or Z. And, um, yeah, we'll take it from there. Thank you so much for watching. If you've gotten this far into the video, I appreciate it more than I can tell you. And, uh, yeah, popping up on your screen will be some other videos now that I hope you find interesting. Please do check them out. Come and have a chat to us on the Discord server. There's no paywall for that. It's just gamers hanging out. So do that. And until next time, bye for now.